My name is Natasha, I am the Youth Coordinator at Stopwatch, so I develop um, projects aimed at engaging with young people and uh, mobilising young people to campaign on Stop and Search um, and, and also interact with the other different groups within Stopwatch, so the legal and the policy groups. I think Stop and Search is a really important issue because it affects so many people, so many members of the community, but yet so many people don't really know about it and don't really understand the impacts that it has on wider society, unless you are one of those people that are being stopped directly. So for me, it's really important that we start to educate groups that, that maybe have never been stopped, you know, which might be white middle class people, that this is a problem that actually does have significant impacts on on your own communities. I feel like it's, it's difficult to uh, motivate young people to um, to get involved in stop and search campaigning because they feel like it's never going to, nothing's ever going to change, nothing they do is ever going to make a difference. They are going to be discriminated by the police and mistreated, you know, up until they're old enough to finally be left alone. Mm -hmm. So it's a challenge to get young people to see that they can make a difference. But hopefully some of the work that we're doing is, is going to play a part in that. Stopwatch wants for everybody to be treated equally um, by the police and in a way that is fair and in a way that respects them. Uh, and I think that you know, so many of the issues that we see in London and across the country in relation to community safety and, and policing and crime is because of this really damaging relationship between communities and the police and I think it's Stopwatch's role to highlight the fact that that is the case highlight the consequences of that relationship and then try and improve that relationship.